Hello! How are you doing today? I hope you're doing well. I realized I never intro this video you're about to watch, so here I am, introing the video. Once we have some walks, we get to see my mom. I'm very excited to share this weekend vlog with you. So, without further ado, here's the vlog. I finally did a dance workout today. I'm so excited. I was, I do, I was probably doing it for a good what? Hour and a half, I would say, probably. It felt so nice. I just really wish that I could keep it up. That's the only thing I kind of struggle with when it comes to my dance workouts. When at first in quarantine, it was just like, yeah, I'm gonna dance two, three times a week at least. And I was for a while. And I used the Just Dance videos. And so, yeah, for a while it was fun. Then I started getting really sick of the same music over and over again. And I would keep adding stuff. And then my list became so long, it was hard to comprehend and follow. So, yeah, and it's been very difficult to stay with it when I start to do that again. I love dancing so much. It's like the best workout. I just wish I could keep it consistent. But anyways, I'm proud of myself nonetheless. Probably gonna hop in the shower soon. Mike is actually teaching his brothers today. They have like a little homeschool class that they take on Friday. So that's exciting. If you listen really carefully, you could probably hear all the birds outside which is so nice like I really like hearing it it's a little robin over there hi robin <sighs> but just listen to that yay it's really I will say I love living by a ravine it is so peaceful I feel like I live at like a safari or a zoo sometimes because I could just hear little tweets through the day especially when it rains they really like rainy days <laughs> hi bunny I love you you're so cool it's so beautiful hello come along with me as I walk up to the store once again <laughs> anyways yeah, it was good. it was sunny before I came out here, and well, it's kind of if you look there, it's really cloudy. And I was so prepared; I had like my sunglasses and everything. And then it ended up not being sunny, so that was fun. Anyways, I have to head to the store, grab a prescription, maybe grab something to eat for later, because Mike's actually going to his friend Stefan's today. I'm always excited for Mike to see his his wife. It's like his best friend from school. He does not see him as often as I see Salika, so <laughs> I am excited. I don't know what I'm gonna do tonight though. I think I might watch High School Musical 2 because I've been wanting to watch it. Yes, High School Musical 2, not the first one. <laughs> I mean, the first one is good too, but the second one's like my favorite. I didn't get to vlog much more when I came back from the store because my hands were super full. So I got some fun snacks for tonight for my own little movie night. And I'm gonna watch High School Musical 2 and it's gonna be fun. I even got myself some sushi and another thing to go along with it for my dinner. That's great. I have officially moved into my room because it's a lot more comfortable to sit in a chair and watch videos than it is to sit on my bed and watch videos. So I'm still super into slow and I guess it's, it's SL04N is actually how it's spelled out. But yeah, Sloan, I just call him Sloan. Super into his videos still. I've been like binging them constantly. <laughs> um, right now I'm just going on a like a binge through all the three Britney videos. So I'm gonna get back to that. Probably watch YouTube for a little bit longer in a couple of hours. I will get myself prepped for food and turn on High School Musical up there. It's gonna be great. All right, here's my my meal of the day. This is a lot of sushi actually, so this might fill me up more than I thought, but I thought I'd get these delicious crab ragoons. I believe that's how they're pronounced. It has crab and cream cheese in it. Yes, and High School Musical. Yes, let's do this thing. I hear the raccoons on the roof. Oh, I wish I had food to give them because right now Mike and I have not gone grocery shopping and I don't really have anything. I ran out of the dog food I was using. I don't have any fruit and even things as simple as Ritz crackers, which I still give to them every once in a while, is gone. A little bread, but I don't, uh, I don't want to try to avoid doing grains as much as possible. But I hear them on the roof in the 
makes me so sad. It makes me so sad when I hear them and I'm like, they're out. But I can't get them food. I want to get them food. It's okay. They're going to just have to hunt for their own food. Like they're made to do. It's weird how like I feel guilty about it, right? Like I should not feel guilty because they are wild animals. I watched High School Musical 2. I had that lovely sushi and crab ragoon dinner that was delicious. Um, I started rhinestoning. I'm working on a rhinestone project for a TikTok actually. <laughs> so yes, I'm doing that. And I watched High School Musical 2, and then I decided that I wanted to... Sorry, don't mind me messing with my hair. I'm tired and I do that a lot. So I decided to watch Sharpay's Fabulous Adventure. I never watched that. It's like the... it's It was like the spinoff of High School Musical after the third movie, the high, their senior year. Like, it was all about Sharpay, though, and I was like, oh, like, I don't know if I really want to watch... A movie just about Sharpay but I was like oh what the heck because I knew that the story probably involved her like getting knocked down a peg and kind of discovering stuff inside herself so yeah and I mean it was actually not that bad it was kind of cute it was it was definitely Disney corny scale for sure um but to be expected <laughs> but I it, it wasn't too bad I actually liked it it was kind of inspiring too so that's cool I might read a book I'm um, still reading Go Ask Alice, which I haven't been reading too much of. It's, I feel like it's almost over. I talked about this a while back. It is kind of a darker story um, that takes place in like the 60s or 70s about someone who made diary entries and dealt with addiction and stuff like that. Uh, went through it. <laughs> and so I've been reading all about that. That's pretty crazy what happened to this person. I'm gonna read that tomorrow. I'm gonna go see my mommy because tomorrow's Mother's Day and we're gonna take a nice little walk at a little farm park that we have near here. So I'm excited about that. It's gonna be really nice to see her, especially on Mother's Day. Ooh. Hi, mommy. <laughs> Happy Mother's Day. Oh, thank you. <laughs> we are at a really pretty park near where I live. And look at that, it's so gorgeous. It does look like a little beaver dam, doesn't it? That's so cool. Yeah. He's like, you can admire me while I eat. Look at the my feet. That'd be really kind of cool. Maybe not at the moment. There's an old piece of playground over here. This is part of the playground that I used to go on when I was a kid. But it wasn't here, it was in a different spot. And now they've replaced it with a completely different playground, which is very odd for me and my nostalgia. <laughs> my poor childhood has faded away. Oh, no. Are you smelling us? He's a friendly one. He's like, do you got food? Oh. <laughs> you are beautiful. No, he doesn't have any food. I'm sorry. <laughs> we can't feed you anyway. We need to feed you. <laughs> True. Sorry. Oh, you're cute though. Oh my goodness. There's another one up there somewhere, but. Down the other side. You gonna come He's like, don't talk about that head? one. I can touch your ears. What do you think? Mm -hmm. You have like a little, it's like a blue heron or like a. Yeah. Oh, he just disappeared. I think it is. We come around this way. <clears throat> oh no, I think he disappeared. Yeah, just behind the grass. Oh. Ugh. Sneaky little fella. <laughs> oh, I'll tell you a story about my, my pet. Oh, there he is. He's like, you can't see me. I am a bush. It's right there. Sometimes it's something just about. I should just keep it out. You guys want attention. Hi, baby. You're so cute. Look at smell me. It's hard to pet you because I don't know if I'm even really supposed to, but. Yeah, it's hard to pet them through there. Hey. Mm. Yeah, you see me? Okay. Some goats. Oh, and a boot. Oh, yeah. Thank you. That makes it. Oh, I want to do that. Can I do that? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Does that feel good, honey? It's so cute. Oh, yeah. 
Oh, yeah, get it. <laughs> oh my god, you guys are so cute. Thank you for letting us pet you. He's like, why did you stop? <laughs> you a bit more. I have to get through, rub your ears proper. <laughs> so guys i hope you enjoyed coming along with my mom and i before i conclude this video i wanted to show you something really cool that i just got so to start off i just want to say that i found this on amazon for a really low price like it was half off the original price i hope it's good like it's, it was like a limited time like discount but it's crazy. So I've had gel pens for a while, right? And they're really, all of them are just dying at this point. Like, they're barely hanging in there. So I found this. This huge, gorgeous set of so many different shades of colors and gel pens. I hope they work. The reviews were pretty decent. But here, let me see. There's like a way to like fold it. So you look at this, it all folds into each other. Isn't that cool? And then I got a little bag, which now that I, I'm looking at it, it's probably going to be too small for them. <laughs> oh well, I'm very excited about this. I'm very, very excited because I have been obsessed with using gel pens lately for everything. And I've been making, I make lists almost every single day to help me stay organized and not get overwhelmed. So I'm so excited. A lot of them are glittery ones too gonna be so cool i'm very excited for this i hope they all work i'll test them out in a little bit but thank you guys so much for coming along on this big weekend vlog but yeah it was really nice seeing my mom today of course it's mother's day so i was really happy to go for a nice long walk with her and just catch up on everything and i also just feel like i've had a pretty good weekend so thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next vlog bye